Hello everybody, my name is Faethodas, welcome to this video, which is a, a way that I play the, this game sometimes. I'm going to show you a farming route. A few weeks ago I, showed, I uploaded a video where I show you a specific route for farming bosses sometimes in the legendary difficulty level. In this route I'm going to show you uh, a way that I farm not bosses but containers. And uh, when we say containers, we talk about uh, chests, sarcophagus, and such uh, th type of uh, things. But also, uh, this uh, route contains even bosses. It is a mix of both uh, containers and bosses. Actually, the most uh, places we are going to visit are, uh, have uh, bosses included. So, we can say that uh, this is a container bosses uh, route. For uh, this reason, I call this route the route CB6, which means containers, bosses, six places. This route has six places to visit. So, now... We start from this area. For this route, uh, we have this rebirth found and activated. So when uh, we the game first launch in this character, we can we come to this place immediately. This is the Helicos Pass. With uh, this is the burning area, and we are going uh, to this sacred olive branch uh, quest. But uh, we are not going for the quest, we are going for the containers and the boss. Let's get ready and let's go. We do not need to kill all the enemies in our way, but we can do that. Now, uh, the hero I'm using for farming is a glass cannon hero. He deals much damage. The boss is dead. So we have uh, three chests here. Three containers. And one majestic chest here. We pick up the gold. A kingly circle of adroitness. This is a green one. Have no more room. But I have no more room. Why? Why are you doing this to me, my man? Okay. Let it go. That is the first area. Now we open a portal and we are going to Sparta. This is the second area. In Sparta we are going to the boss Nessus, which is a cedar. And we are going to kill this boss and open the chests, containers that are in this area of this boss. So, what I was saying uh, before is that uh, this is a glass cannon build, so I'm going to die sometimes in this route uh, video, I'm going to show you. Uh, the boss is dead. I love killing Sedars, I don't know why. Here we come to a majestic chest. We open the chest. And we find nothing good except this stuff, green stuff, but I'm not going to pick it up. Then we come here, we kill all those uh, beasts, monsters, pigs, shamans, satyrs, what the hell, sedars, and we open three more containers. That is the second area. The third area is a hard one for this uh, character. We are going to Hades Act, Elysium. And we are going to the Elysium cave. This cave has no boss at all, but it has uh, many containers. But... Uh, as you can see, I take too much damage here. 
This is not good. I'm going to die, I guess. Yes. Okay. My piercing resistance is, is very low. So, this character is dying pretty much in areas like this one. Let's go again. Kill all those idiots. Demons! Demons! <laughs> Demons! Demonic invasion! What is he doing here? This demon has lost his way. Let's kill this Limos. This skeleton too. So, the next area is this one. There are many sarcophagus here. Oh, what the hell? I have to do something to make this uh, character more... have more survivability, because this is ridiculous. I see an arcane formula on the ground. Let me kill those uh, undead. So as you can see in this uh, cave, this is a small cave, but anyway, we get many containers. If you like opening containers, this is the spot for you. Container farming is good for uh, health, energy potions, and uh, gold coins, actually. We are not going to find many epic or legendary items in the, uh, this type of farming. At least not from this type of containers. So, that was the third area for this farming route. Now, we open a portal and we are going... Where are we going? We are going to Egypt Act at Memphis. Let's go to Memphis. There is great music in this Memphis area. So now, we are taking Gate of the Palm. We are going from here. This is uh, the road that leads to the new boss of the Anniversary Edition, Masika. And uh, this boss have uh, a very great chest to farm. But we are not going only for this chest, we are actually... This uh, road we are now is the farming road, the farming place for this farming road. Let me kill those guys. As you saw, there was a container here. And all along this way, we are going to find many containers. One more here. Kill those guys. Pick up the gold. Is there... No, there is no container. We move on. Sometimes uh, a container spawns in this area. Also here. No container here! Ah, bad luck today. Come on! Usually a container spawns here, but now I'm very... this very unlucky moment. Let's kill demons. 
Oh! The same goes for this place here too. But why no containers? Come on! Is this a joke? Joke? Also containers are in this area. There it is, one. Up here too. Let's pick up the gold. No, not now. Okay, this is not good. This is Shrine of Healing. I don't need this. Also, containers spawn in this area. There are two containers here now. Most of the times I take this road, I find at least a 7 to 10 containers. But now I'm very unlucky. I don't know what happened. Now we come here to this container. We kill those birds. Pick up the container. Nothing. And now we come to the boss Masika. 5 Eo Sika. We kill this boss. Oh. Nice. And we open this majestic chest. Too many gold pieces, an arcane formula, and everything yellow. Okay. Officially, I am very unlucky in this uh, run. Anyway, that was the fourth, the fourth, sorry, the fourth uh, place to visit for this route. The next one is to Giza. We are going to Giza. And now we are going to visit uh, this uh, lair of the Sphinx. This is for the uh, main boss, but we find some uh, bone piles. Called... Hey, wow! A legendary! You can't hold Abyssal seal! Did you see that? A bone pile, a simple bone pile, dropped Abyssal seal. But uh, where can I put the seal? I have no uh, place in my inventory. No space. Oh! <laughs> Why are you doing this to me? Now I have. Aha. One more container. Ouch! Kill these undead people. And dead people in my way. Now we are going here. And uh, we are going to find many containers in here. If we are lucky enough. Usually there are spawns many containers, but we will see. Here it is, the first one. A green stuff of I don't care. As you can see, three more containers. One, two, three. Okay, they are dead. Let's go here. Two more containers here. One more container here, and many are dead zombies. Of course, the zombies could not be dead, they should be undead. And uh, let's see. Kill those undead too. Hound of Anubis. Two more containers here. Two more containers here. Uh, give me your gold. Let's move on. 
One more container, a large coffer. One more. More zombies to kill. Die, die, die my darling. I'm going to kill this device too. And uh, now we are almost to the boss. One more container, royal coffer. Nice. Hail engraved ring. No oh, not even a ring. My inventory is full. I cannot pick up a ring. Throw down to the ground all this piece of nothing. Uh, I don't need these items. For now, go away. Where? Oh! There it is, the ring. My precious! And we move on, there is a boss. And after we kill this boss, we get more containers. This will be a very quick fight. We are going to obliterate this boss. Come on, hit me, hit me hard. Construct. Come on, you two, hit me hard. Pharaoh's Honor Guard. Add one more statue to kill. Kill the statues. Okay, you are dead. And one, two, three, four containers, including a majestic chest. Uh, two green items. Okay, not so good luck. Anyway, now we open the portal and we are going to our final uh, place, which is in the Fayum. Waypoint. It is uh, the Fayum town in the Fayum oasis. And now we are going up there to the boss. This boss. We are going to kill this scorpion boss. And we are going to open its containers. Table of Atum. Nice. We find the coffer here. <coughs> Nothing good. We break this column. And uh, let's hope this boss is not going to kill us because this is a uh, 68 level. Okay, he cannot kill me, I guess. Think again. Ah! Oh! And we have one, two, three, four, five containers. Majestic chest. Nothing. Majestic chest. Coffer, coffer, and coffer. Everything yellow and one green axe. Oh! Resistant plate arm pads of trickery. Pick this up and sell it. <laughs> so, that's it. Uh, this is the route, guys. It uh, consists of six places. Uh, let me show you again. Let's uh, make a summarize. Uh, first, we begin from the Helicos Pass, which is... Uh, to the road to, the, to Delphi 
Then we are going to Sparta to kill Nessus, the Sedar. After this, we are going to Hades Elysium to clear the cave. Then we are going to Egypt, to Memphis, and from this area we are going to Masika and open the containers in our way. Then we are going to Giza and we are going uh, to the cave inside the dojo which uh, leads to the boss. And the final place is in the Fayum Desert, the Fayum Oasis, where we are coming here and we kill the scorpion boss and we open its containers. So this is uh, the container bosses farming route, the CB6 farming route. It is a good route if you want to try it. Too many containers, too many gold coins and health and energy potions to pick up. And if you are lucky, some epic and legendary items. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, hit the like button, share and subscribe for more videos. And uh, I will see you and you will see me in the next video. Bye bye.